Hello everyone, welcome back to another Adobe Premiere Pro 2020 tutorial. Guys, in this one, I'm going to show you how to basically export footage or video right into Adobe Stock. And why am I showing you this? Because apparently you can make money doing this. I haven't made any money doing this. I just put my first video in uh, just a couple minutes ago, actually. But uh, this could be a new way for you guys to make some money and for us to make some money. I'm going to show you how to do it in Premiere Pro without any magic and nice and simple. So it's actually not simple. So uh, let's just get right into this. Let's, let's dig it. All right, the first step here is you want to use your own footage. Caveat number one, it has to be under 60 seconds. So I'll just put that out there. If the video is over 60 seconds, you got to trim it to under 60. I've got a nice video here of, I took some footage the other day for a, a promo shot that I'm doing and it's just a girl pouring some beer. So I'll just hit space bar and you'll see here, Yes, yeah, some nice lady just pouring a beer. All right. Not exactly exciting footage, but it might do the trick for Adobe Stock. So there you go. We've got that footage. Step one. Now, step two is you want to, well, you could be, if you're following along, use any footage as long as you own it. It's your footage. So I just want to put that out there too. Now, the next step, guys, you want to go to File. You want to go to Export. You want to go to Media. This is pretty standard stuff here, but here's where it gets interesting. You want to go to H.264, but in Adobe Premiere Pro 2020, there are some new options. And if you have the updated uh, Creative Cloud membership, you should, be, you should be seeing this. When you drop down Match Source High Bit Rate, we are going to not select that, actually. We're going to go down to Adobe Stock. Now, Adobe Stock has six settings, and really, really quickly, they're HD, they're UHD, and 4K. HD is standard stuff, 1920 by 1080, 1280 by 720, but 1920 by 1080 is the is the preferred one. Um, then UHD and 4K, they're almost the same. The only difference is 4K is about is exactly 256 pixels wider, so it's like proper 4K, where UHD is like almost it's like pseudo 4k it's not quite there so there is a little bit of a difference now in this footage that I took it's just on my what am I using I'm using my iPhone on this one with my Osmo 3 and actually this would be 4k footage so this is proper 4k so I'm gonna select Adobe stock 4k DCI and that stands for digital creative Institute or something like that DCI I can't remember um, but anyways, this is the one we're going to select, and it has audio. It says 40 megabytes per second. So I'm clicking on this. Now, we're at the next step, and this is an incredibly important step, is you want to go over here to Publish. Now, inside Publish, there you can see you can upload directly to your Creative Cloud account, but you also now have a checkbox, and you can now directly upload into your, um, your Adobe Stock account. Now, if you are not a member or if you haven't signed up for this, there is some tomfoolery that you have to go through. It's not, it's not super user friendly. So I have signed up and I'm going to hit export and we're going to see what happens. Actually, while we export, I'm going to show you some other stuff here. So when we go to dashboard, like I am now in my Adobe stock while that we go through the exporting process and you're going to see here that I've earned nothing. I've got no downloads. Um, but here's the thing, they pay 35% commission apparently, so if somebody uses this thing and they buy it, you get 35% of whatever the hell they paid for it. Now, when I go to my dashboard, I'm going to go to Uploaded Files, and you're going to see here that I've actually got a couple of files here that I've uploaded, and these are just sort of sitting there. That's just me doing stand-up comedy, for example, but I've got some releases here, I believe. So when I click on this, you're going to see here that this is submitted it was submitted today and it's sent to model now I am no model let's be on <laughs> let's be straight up here but guys I have a release so this one here is in review and it says here that the moderation team will guess contact me or review within the next few days so there is a process that you go through you do have to sign up and get approved and once you've gone through the that tomfoolery then you'll be good to go. So anyways, guys, here we go. We're uploading the file directly. And then in a few short seconds, oh, come on. I have a faster computer than that, even though it's thermal and it's throttling like a big bad word. 
Okay, there we go. So this is the deal now, guys. I'm going to be putting these in here. Now, once you put them in, I'm going to walk you through the next step. So it should be here in the next few seconds. Dum dee dum dee dum dum dee dum dee dum. Tell me a joke. Come on, guys. Normally, I would just edit this out and then go 30 seconds later, but um, no, I'm all right with that. So here we go. So please go to the link below to finalize for your submission. So I'm going to left click on that right here. And it's going to open it up in Safari, of course, because I'm in uh, I'm on a Mac. So once you see that, you're going to see here in a few seconds that it's going to be here. It's not here yet. Let's click over here. Click New. The beer thing should be here. Okay, well, it hasn't showed up. I'm going to hit OK. Oh, there it goes. Okay, guys, so it says here we've got all three. Now, again, releases. We've got one in release. We've got none rejected. We've got one in review. And of course, this isn't here. So what am I even talking for? All right, I am back. <laughs> All right, there it is, guys. It was a little slower than I thought, but here it is. It is in my little uploaded files buggy. Now, I want to get this bad boy reviewed. Here we go. File type video. So you're going to see here, include in submission. We don't want to do that yet. Recognizable people or property? No. This is just standard beer taps. You would never know where the heck it is. Now you want to select some keywords. I'm going to do beer, uh, beer, gla uh, glass, um, pub, tavern, glasses, C7 keywords remaining, alcohol, store, rack. I don't know. How about um, beer, glass? Something like that. Shoes? No. Um, pour beer, pub. Uh, bar, no, uh, stupid things, right? Like you could just select, um, what, what else would you guys put in here? Uh, head, <laughs> uh, I'll leave that one out. I won't say any more about that. Okay. All right, good. We've got some, we've got some stuff in there and we're going to go like, uh, pouring beer. Let's go with that for a title. Okay, good. And it is drinks. So the, so the category is correct. I'm writing keywords in English. So all of these things here look to be correct. I'm going to submit for approval. Here we go. And submission is going on, guys. It is now going into review. It'll probably take a few seconds because this isn't as fast as I would like it to be. And it's all getting done in the, cr in the cloud. But uh, in a second here, it will show up in review. It's in review, guys. It'll take a couple days for people to take a look over. But here you go. Two videos in review in Adobe Stock. I don't know if I'll ever make any money off them. Probably not, but there's a chance. But that's the process, step by step, front to back. I hope you enjoyed this video. Got a lot more stuff coming up.